Hi everyone, I'm Belen from Peru and I'm 24 and in today's video I'm going to tell you about my experience traveling with EF and how did EF change my life. I've been traveling with EF since I was 16. In 2012 I went to Bristol in the UK. It was a unique experience and I found out my passion is to travel. It was my first time traveling alone and I was so far from home but I met many people and I made many friends and I had so much fun in the school that I didn't have time to think about how much I miss home. And I'm not going to forget how amazing was my first EF experience and I miss my classmates. Bristol is an amazing city with many things to do. You are going to find art all around the city. When I came back to Peru after my EF Bristol experience, I joined the EF Ambassador program and I had the opportunity to travel to the EF Ambassador meeting in Miami in 2014, where I met EF students and EF ambassadors from different countries. Chile, Argentina, Ecuador and more. I was decided to travel again with EF. So in 2015 with my ambassador points I went to Oxford. I went back to the UK but this time for almost two months. By that time I was over 18 so I went to many parties. I had so much fun in Oxford. When I was studying in EF Oxford I had the opportunity to travel to Scotland as part of the EF activities. We were around 60 people or maybe more in that trip and I had so much fun in Scotland. Also we had a ghost tour. In 2019, I had many EF experiences. First, in March, I went to EF Cape Town in South Africa for two weeks. The school was beautiful and I fell in love with the city. There are many activities to do in Cape Town. You can go surfing, you can go on a safari, and there are many trekking routes in Cape Town. I'm in love with that city. And I'm glad in all my EF experiences, I had the best host families. I miss them. Also that year I was invited to be part of the first Hello VC in Washington in the United States. We did many things, but my favorite was the EF Dance Flash Mob in Lincoln Memorial. I'm not going to forget that trip and especially that moment. We were more than 60 people from different countries. We were EF students telling all the people around Washington about EF and telling them our experiences. And in December, I participated to be part of EF TV. I was invited to be part of it, so I attend to Bentonville, Arkansas with seven more people. I met some of them in Hello DC in June. And I can say EF changed my life because I'm keeping my dream alive, my dream about going places in life.